Hello there, Paul here, and I'm excited to share with you what we have in the latest updates in Photoshop on the iPad. And you can see right above me, the smudge tool and the sponge tool. Love these two. I'm on my own layer. I'm gonna select the smudge tool. I'm gonna go into some of the settings. I'm gonna sample all layers, uh, use pressure for size, and make sure the strength is cranked all the way up. And then I can just kind of jump in and then start just quickly creating whatever I want using the smudge tool. Gives me that nice, 3D painterly effect, as you can see, uh, very quickly. So that works out pretty well. In fact, I can jump in and use the sponge tool and make sure that's set to saturate. Then I can jump in and give it some more depth, like make it pop on the parts that look like they're sticking out more, right? Just kind of running over parts of these letters, giving it that pop and making it look great, all using this latest update in Photoshop on the iPad. So check it out today.